hi guys welcome back to another vlog um excuse the mess around me if you visited my last vlog you'll know that the house needs a clean but wedding fair preparations begin um let me literally move this out of shot wedding fair preparations begin and tomorrow i am taking part in a wedding fair in berkshire Hampshire, I think it's in Hampshire or Berkshire, at Wokefield Park, which is a Devere, and we are, we, well I have actually got a friend helping me, which is lovely, so we've got a stall, and I'll be doing my bridal makeup, a first ever stall, first time I've ever advertised it, so if you're new here, thank you so much for joining, I'm Andrea, I'm a beauty therapist, and I have a bridal makeup kind of business on the side, and it's picked up very very well this year where all brides are of course getting married um which is so lovely but it kind of got to a point now where i felt like i needed to expand that advertise more and get more brides in because i put so much money into makeup in the last i'd say four months um both vegan makeup just lovely new makeup bits and it just makes sense for me to showcase what i've done and kind of give it a chance. So these bridal stalls, so this um, this might just be interesting for anyone, but for anyone looking to do a stall um, as a wedding supplier, these bridal stalls, this one cost me 125 pounds just to have the stall. And then of course you've got the marketing on top, and I must admit, I was a little bit in over my head at the start, but we're here, we're here. I've ordered loads of bits. I'm gonna show you what I've done just to give anyone some hin hints and tips and just a little bit of fun. I need to sort myself out today. But also the most exciting thing is if you've watched my last vlog, you'll notice I've still got the burn on my hands. So they're starting to go down. So I won't show that again. But I got engaged a couple of days ago. So um, yeah, whirlwind, absolute whirlwind. However, this means that the the wedding fair kind of means so much more to me because I can go and I can kind of snoop. I can't really leave my stall, but uh, my friend helping me can actually do that. So I don't have a plan. In fact, I think today is going to be one of those days I'm going to try and film as much as I can and I'm going to film tomorrow as well at the fair. But it's going to be one of those days I think where I'm just running around like a headless chicken. I would really, really love to do my nails. Um, but I think I need to prioritise things. And also, I, don't, I really don't think I should be putting... No, I'm not doing my nails because I shouldn't be putting my burns... Um, I burnt my hand. Uh, burns under the lamp. So the nails are just going to have to hopefully stay on. It's just not ideal. But... Um, we move and um, yeah so keep watching if you want to see exactly what I've got I'll show you some beats that I've got so far and then I need to shoot off to meet a friend for a coffee but I need to en route pick up my stuff I'm running so late already oh my god you know when you look at the time and you're like time is not on my side today but I can do this I've got this right let me show you quickly what I've got so far got these beautiful flowers so inside here oh i really need to unravel these i'll show you but inside here is some like wonderful um white little flowers here and you know like those bunny are they called bunny ears the little pampas bunny ears and um, so i got these from feather and nest they do have an online store but i got them in the shop and they were not that cheap <laughs> i've got a chopping board bear with me here but i've got a lovely lovely sign hopefully that will go on the chopping board i've got an amazon package which i need to get into and i think my neighbor's got the other one as well um and i'm going to be making up some little treat bags for the guests for anyone who visits what else have i got oh Honestly, on reflection, I have bought so much. So I've got this made from Photo Box, which took me so long, but it's so, it's so lovely. Um, it's not as big as I hoped, and it was really expensive, but um, it's got like my packages. Um, so that's like my, my portfolio. And I think at the side it says that, um, yeah this isn't for me to promote my business whatsoever i just want to give anyone some ideas i've got a journal here so this the idea of this is that i write anyone's email in um but i might keep it for myself after as like a i can't close it as a wedding thingy um what else have i got i did pick up these from next so these are some beautiful 
gold frames and I got ooh, two small ones and two and one big one and I'm about to head to Reading now to go and pick up from Harlequin signage some um, promotional bits that I've got so a mustache this is from Alice J's design she is a signage writer so she does a lot of wedding signs business signs it's all acrylics I genuinely think it is stunning here it is I'm just so impressed I think this is a three size so this is gonna go up um, at the show I'm just so impressed with that I think I'm gonna use her dare I say it I think I might use her for um, potentially for like our seating plans or like the like welcome what's it called like the welcome sign at a wedding so pleased with that I will link her Instagram below she's so good a really good service morning it is the morning of the wedding fair and i wanted to film so much more but it has been a busy 24 hours last night i had a little bit too much prosecco um no honestly i'm fine but i have just stopped off at mcdonald's to um get myself a much needed coffee my burns on my hands are dying down but i'm gonna plaster them up for today um I'm just excited. I'm so excited. So I'm gonna hopefully film. Like I'm gonna see how much I can film of the venue and how much I can like generally film. Um, I don't really know what to expect. My friends meeting me there, so that's great because I've got a helping hand. But anyway, I'm gonna drink my coffee and I'm gonna head to the fair. P.S. I've got my. This is ASOS. I think it's. I think it's ASOS, not New Look, but I think it's ASOS. But it's maternity. <laughs> I really wanted like a dress like this, like full length midi, so I've popped a belt on because obviously where it's maternity, it has the bit that goes out at the belly, um, which means it's longer at the end, so I've popped a belt on and I've got my white trainers on, so I'm super comfy. <laughs> since 5 30 which is not is not okay i look <laughs> so tired hi i thought i would kind of wrap this video up because i didn't actually film much of the wedding band i'm so sorry um, i'm having a bit of a bad skin day today it's actually Friday today, the wedding fair was on Sunday, it went really well, I've had some inquiries, that's really good, um, but I think I've just hit it a little bit hard the last couple of days, and I'm talking like, just stress, not stress, it's the wrong word to use I think, but just keeping busy, keeping up appearances, all that kind of stuff, so I'm just going to kind of try and take a nice day today, nothing on my skin, burn update, they look really bad but they are drying up so um i don't show you my legs they're not looking too fantastic at the moment but i went out for a lovely dinner last night in wokingham oh have you got your elephant so i need to clean the house i'm on my it is now i think 20 past seven i'm on my second cup of coffee which i'm tempted to make a third that light is actually really bright isn't it um i don't know if that's really distracting <laughs> So I'm on my second cup of coffee. I'm really desperate to try and find my cardigan. I wanted to film a H&M haul um, or something maybe similar, but I cannot 
find two of the bits. I don't know what I've done with them. So I need to find them and then perhaps in one video, maybe not a whole haul, but it'll be part of. So I've got some really lovely autumn, like transitional bits from H&M. But we're heading to Oxford tomorrow just to do a bit of mooching, a bit of looking around. And I'm actually surprising Sean with a meal with his parents are gonna be there. So we're going somewhere called Victor's. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to vlog because it might just be a bit busy and I might not end up taking my camera, but we are also going to view a wedding venue in the morning. So I think how this channel's gonna go for a little bit is beauty skincare, and I still can't get over how awful that looks. Um, beauty skincare and a lot of wedding content. But yeah, we're going to view a wedding venue tomorrow which is so exciting. This venue is in Berkshire and it's really not what we thought we would go for, but I've kind of fallen in love with it. It's a bit more um, understated, smaller, and yeah, I'll see what I can video. It might only be the outside, but I'm gonna try, try and share my um, wedding planning journey with you. And I'm telling you now, it is not going slow we have six venues lined up and the reason being you know everyone's like you should en enjoy your engagement i am and what i'm really enjoying about it is the planning my dream when i was younger was to be a wedding planner so the idea of planning my own wedding within a certain budget is um it's just filling me with joy so um and sean's on board as well i'm not forcing him to do anything he doesn't want to do but i think what we want to do is we want to compare venues quite close like in, in a range of weeks but quite close together so and getting time off together can be quite tricky but we've managed it so yeah thank you so much for watching i hope and this is such a random vlog um um, I was going to show you some makeup bits that I'm absolutely loving, but that would involve me like setting up the camera in a proper place. Um, I'm just being real here. I've just woken up. This is my face. Um, I have washed it. I've got my SPF on, but I am a little bit raw. I've got a few um, active spots at the moment, so I didn't want to do like a makeup routine or anything like that because I just want to let my skin breathe today. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video, which will be, what will be my next video? If I manage to get anything of tomorrow, I'll insert it in this vlog, I think, um, unless I get a lot of content and then I'll do another one. But my next video, I am gonna be trying out, I'm gonna promise this, but I, I don't know if I could like, I feel like I'm over promising maybe. Um, but I've got a NARS palette that I bought so long ago. I'm talking like two months ago, it's the Orgasm on the Beach NARS palette, it is stunning and I've still not used it because I wanted to use it with you guys, so I'm going to try and film that this weekend, it's a busy weekend though, I'm struggling to fit time in to like film sit down videos, like vlogging is actually quite easy at the moment because I feel like I can just be like me but sit down is almost like you have to tidy everything away and I'm a real person, I have two jobs, I have a dog, I have a life that, well, I mean, it's if, I don't normally have a life, I'm quite a stay at home kind of person, but at the moment, it, life is a bit busy, so for me to like keep on top of tidying is like, however, I love a tidy house, tidy house, tidy mind. So, this has gone on for six minutes of me just rambling. I'm going to enjoy the rest of my coffee. I hope you're all so, so well. And I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs> Holly, where you go?